Sculpture is about the whole material world and the basic thing is how material affects us. We're looking at it being in its, in its presence of the material, how it changes our reality, how it changes our life. I think that's a really important job and nothing else is doing that. Sculpture is really the, an investigation of what, of what form does to us and what it means to us. In this position, I, I think it's strategic to have this here. Yeah, and also, I mean, maybe because it's a red work and we're surrounded with a lot of green. Mm. I think it's fine, it's good. That's uh, very nice. The Wobbly Gardens, in fact, started their life as sculpture gardens. So we have classical Greek and Roman sculptures, we have Renaissance statuary, and then we have lots of uh, Baroque uh, sculptures and we just pick up this tradition, we continue it, we bring it into the present time. It's fantastic to see so much good sculpture, past and present, in, in, in communication with each other. Tony's work, with its inherent energy and busyness and frenetic energy, is very well, very well equipped for. A space like this is almost like an outdoor gallery. It was very nice, and uh, so we could have these isolated situations. Uh, it's a sort of, yeah, it's a, it's a sort of controlled nature that you're in, and then there are the situations where you're in more formal, uh, in the garden and in the responding to things. But I, I feel it really does put life into the situation. We know this kind of geometries and this formality of the situation, but it's a new vitality. It's a new sign of life in that situation.